What's up, LV viewers, and welcome back to Dark Deception Monsters Immortals. I don't know about you guys, but uh, things look a little different today, but there's a very good reason for that. For the first time on the channel, we are diving into the world of Monsters Immortals modding. People have essentially taken this game back into Unreal Engine, the program this game was initially made in, and have modified it to their own liking. Some There's, there's some mods out there, you know, like visual, audio, you know, there's stuff like that, but nothing has ever gone this far. This is the Five Nights at Freddy's mod. Uh, David Barron, the creator of the mod, very talented, cool guy, was able to provide me an early access copy, and I can't wait to get into this thing. Foxy on the main menu here looks absolutely killer, I love how he looks, however, there is something else to really sink our teeth into. We have revitalized, revamped maps, visually. Nothing's changed code-wise for this mod, because we can't do that with mods. Um, we have Five Nights at Freddy's 3, replacing Monkey Business, and we also have the original location from the first FNAF, replacing Elementary Evil, and uh, enough introducing. Let's see what this mod is really capable of. Five Nights at Freddy's Perilous Pizzeria. Let's get into this. Oh boy. I am not ready for this. So immediately we already have... Uh, we have two animatronics we could play as. We could play as Freddy Fazbear, Gold Classic Freddy, and uh, Foxy the Pirate. These replace Gold Watcher and Lucky the Rabbit respectively. I'm gonna go Freddy, cause, you know, he's Freddy. I like myself some Foxy, but mm, let's be honest, Lucky's a bit broken. So instead we are just gonna go good old classic Freddy, and we even have a few skins to choose from, but I think I'm just gonna go with good old classic, uh, regular Freddy. What are we gonna throw for Golden Demise? It's not gonna be axes, are we gonna throw microphones? That'd be kind of funny, actually. See, even all the UI is adjusted, and just look at this, this is elementary evil. This is, this is Elementary Evil, guys. Here's reference of how Elementary Evil normally looks. Everything has been modded, every texture, every model, it's all been replaced, and we even have animatronics here, that is so cool. Aw, oh, man. We can't go over there, of course, but... Aw, oh, man, this is so awesome. Aw, uh, and even all that has changed. Oh, oh, there's a Foxy. Hey, Foxy. Oh, hello, Bonbon. Bon. Oh, and even the music is very creepy, very fnaf if I do say so myself, with the phone calls. Custom animations, some of this is even custom models, maybe? It's insane. Uh, massive amount of respect to David Barron for putting this all together. This is ridiculously insane, and look at this! Just, it's so much! And we can't go in the bathrooms, of course, because the thing with mods is that you can't replace any code, as far as I know. So, you can only replace, like, visual stuff, the presentation, the audio. Um, you can't do anything else, and that makes sense. You know, it's a multiplayer game, you don't want messing- Oh god, that is- Uh, hi! Oh, I hear a Reaper nurse. Okay, okay. I don't even know what that security badge item does. What's this room? Oh, it's like a prize counter. Oh, it's the puppet! Boss time. I- I know what the boss time is. Trap time 2. Oh god, look at that! Yeah, so these are what the portals are replaced by. They're replaced by crying children. And instead of the letters, we got plushies. Okay, we're invisible. I think we should probably... Who's near us? Oh no, it's the plushie. Freddy, no! I am you! I am you! No, Bonnie. No. Oh god. This music is so good, though. Aw, oh, this is this is Living Tombstone song. It's so cool. TC just got murdered by a child. There is Foxy. If we're gonna attack anyone, might as well be Foxy. You know, he's he's of our own breed. I have no idea what that even does. I'm gonna have to pay a little visit down somewhere. What did we just do? Oh! We laid down a plush. Wait. Oh with a banana! Oh, the plush is a banana, everyone. Never thought I would say that sense, but here we are. Okay, that speeds us up. That makes sense. No, you don't. Uh, oh, we are throwing microphones. Hey, look at that. That was, that was a really... Oh, no. I know you're there. I know you're there. Somewhere. Oh. 66, of course. Two sixes. 
Okay, while we're in ghost mode, let's do some minor exploration. There's a party room right here that is so cool. I think even the FNAF 1 office is somewhere in this map, so I kind of want to try to find that. We even have the rule sign from FNAF 1. Don't touch Freddy, yeah, don't touch me. So that lays down. Yep, that is definitely a plush. We have a spring trap side effect. What does that mean? Uh, you have it too. Is it fear? It might be fear. That's what I'm thinking. Oh, you laid down a plushie. No. We only- No! No! We only approve of Freddy Fazbear plushies! Don't bring in that golden ripoff. 5 a.m. Aw, so that- that's- Yep, it's the end of the match. Get with those. What is the trap time track? I don't think I remember exactly what it was. Oh, hi! Oh, boss time again! Oh, no, Foxy! No! The real one's over you- over there somewhere. Oh, we have a puppet plushie too! Oh, wait, wait, whoa, are there multiple? Yeah, there are actually two puppet plushies. Hey, Freddy! 6 a.m. It is 6 a.m., guys. Do we win? Oh, Jesus, no. At least we have the chilling yet very ominous noise of Freddy's music box to make us feel a bit better about our failure. Well, that was Perilous Pizzeria, i.e. FNAF 1's reskin. However, we are not done. There is one other map that we can look at. Um, before we do that, actually, let me quickly look at the tutorial. Ah, oh, even that's been changed, that's cool. Uh, what was... what did I want to find out? Um, it was the badge. Invincibility, okay. Enough of that. We're gonna get on to Five Nights at Freddy's 3, Fazbear's Fright. Here we go. I decided to change it to Soul Collection just because we don't have enough people to do a full lobby. So I figured Soul Collection would be fine. Plus, there are some mortals in this pack as well. Notoriously, we got Markiplier. Oh man, here he is. Look at him. Aw, oh, nice. He looks insanely cool. And even we got Michael Afton from uh, a ver variety of FNAF games, actually. Uh, mainly sister location and pizzeria sim. But of course, we're just gonna go with Markiplier. I mean, come on, it's Markiplier. Oh, look how grungy this looks. This is awesome. This is cool. Oh, man. Uh, oh, and it feels a lot more claustrophobic even, which is kind of funny because, you know, it's monkey business. So, this is FNAF 3, Fazbear's Fright. Um, gonna be honest, I'm actually not sure what the boss is. Um, spring trap? I don't know. What's the boss gonna be? Trap time, well, what are... Oh! Uh, because it's just bananas, it's just Golden Freddy plushies. Aw, oh, the music box. Oh man, this is... I love this mod already. It is... It had, it had a lot of effort put into it. It's insane. It's coming out very soon, so definitely give it a try. Um... It's just so cool. And the hello, Pen Pen. Hello there. Uh... Oh. Okay, uh... Whoa! Oh, that's a puppet! Ow, okay, okay. No, you don't. No, 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 no. Oh, and even has the voice lines from Markiplier. Get me out of here. No, I got an invincibility. Oh, dear. Okay. Uh, we might need to warp away. These voice lines are priceless. Oh. God, adding Markiplier was like the best thing they could have done. Uh, oh, oh, hi. I don't like that. No, 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 no. I might, I, I'm probably dead. I'm probably dead. I'm probably dead. Get over here. Let me slap you. <laughs> am I even holding a tablet? I actually... I don't think I am. Interesting. Uh, oh, is there something that way I shouldn't know about? It's so ominous how every time you destroy one of those, it's a Golden Freddy laugh. That is... so cool, honestly. Now get over here. Get over here. Oh, uh, no, no! That's something I gotta censor. <laughs> I was about to say that his reaction was essentially mine and silly throwing an F-bomb. I just want to quickly note how horrible we are doing. 68 shards, that is actually embarrassing. That is... not good. Really not good. I swear I'm better at this game, guys, but the new map just... I don't know, it's throwing me off in terms of, like, how I usually play. I usually know these maps like the, like, you know, the backside of my hand. But it's a lot harder. When it's looking like this, it looks all- whoa, 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 I guess I'm a monkey now. We, we just got owned by Golden Freddy. I'm not gonna go after you, because you're not Shard Leader. I'm gonna go after whoever 
is currently in the lead to screw them over and maximize their frustration. I just want to be able to tell... No, you're not the shard leader. Who is? It must be the other pen pen. Gotcha! Kill! Aw, oh, that kill thing looked so cool. The fact that we... Uh, it just said upon me that we haven't got a kill at all this video before that. And the one kill we get was a Primal Fear kill. What's that? Oh, is that Golden Freddy? Oh my... Yeah, that was Golden Freddy! Oh, that's so cool. Are you Shard Leader, perhaps? Well, that was just mean. Stun them both. Yeah, that... Alright, now you're Shard Leader, so now I can definitely kill you. There we go. And now we can go after the Beerus again. You're ulting. Uh... 6am? Dang, that was close. We did absolutely horrible. I'm sorry, guys. Visuals wow me. This map looked amazing. I swear, I'm much better at Monsters Immortals. I swear. I have the screenshots to prove it. Great job! Now, get out. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. I'll take it. But that is the early access for David Barron's Five Nights at Freddy's mod. This is looking insane so far, and I've already gotten a little bit of a sneak peek at some of the mod's future content that's planned, and it equally looks impressive. This is a really awesome thing. And this is my first time playing a Monsters Immortals mod on the channel. There's a few of them out there, it's not like the craziest scene, but there is some really cool stuff out there, and this is by far the craziest thing I have seen the community turn Monsters Immortals into. Lots of love and care is being put into this, and I'm very happy to support it. And I hope you guys do as well if you guys decide to check it out. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great rest of your day. Bye bye!